harder level, the harder levels with small Mario, more consistent to complete. Let's let, let's just do this. Three, two, one. My timer's starting early. God dang it! This is not what I expect for the first attempt. All right. There we go. Where's my bird's aggressive? Let's see what Bowser will do today. Bumping and slowing down delayed me a little too much. That's all fine. That's fine. No problem. Hey Nick, welcome. Today. Already crazy. Hmm. I actually just started. I just I just started attempts actually. Last session I did, I couldn't get anything faster than a 2156. Okay, my emulator's dropping frames already. Ah, these cheeps. Sometimes these cheeps are in a situation where I can't actually jump through without getting caught. I practiced a lot of stuff yesterday, 
and some days prior. Hopefully today goes much better with worthless runs. Also, as you can see, I'm like looking where Bowser's jumping. If I see him jump forwards, I can just run under. I don't have to deal with the, the safety platform that's above. Which is really nice. Also, I got some more consistent strategies for uh, 3-1, for example. Uh, oh, no. Alright, I wasn't supposed to stomp the second Goomba there. Because then that messed up all my jumping cues. I'm supposed to cross those two and then make my jump over here. There's... Jumping the staircase here at the end, I found a consistent trick. Watch. 344 without the pipe jump. Easy. It would net me faster frame rolls if I didn't die. <laughs> this level's free. So, like, I want to get sub 20 without power ups first. Once I get a valuable time under 20 minutes, then I'll break out the fire flower tricks. Like, I'll be going for the mushroom in 1 2, fire flower 1 4. Oh. Oh, I almost got fireworks. That almost ticked into a 243, which would have cost me about a second and a half. Mainly just building up my consistency, so I can get more chances to be ahead of my run going into the later worlds. It's mainly trying to get out of world 5, world 5, world 7, and just trying to get into 8-3. 8-3 is the one level that is pretty much luck based no matter what. Also 3-4. You don't, if you don't know what pattern you're on, you would have to just guess for the photo boost. But it's better to just slow down like that. Just slow down as you need. I've been trying to top my two-year-old PB from uh, January 2018, and if I can get any PB, which would be free if I die no more than twice, or have a single fatal death in the castle stage, then I would have a shot for this. It'd be really nice, because then I'd have a much more recent PB to compare it to, and it would feel much better. So then I can look at where I'm really losing time with my current strategies. Would I be interested in a puzzle game tournament? Not sure, it depends what you want to do. Depends on what you want to have. Because, like, for, you could probably do, like, panel attack. Not sure about Puyo Puyo. There's not too many puzzle games I get interested in. Puzzle Bobble, no thanks. I'm not well versed in. I'm not well versed in some games. Like, do you have an idea what specific puzzle game you want to do for a tournament? Nick. Nine MAME games? MAME? Really? I mean, I'm able to stream MAME games. Just the thing is, I'm gonna have to set up my thing accordingly. And I'm not sure, cause I have, cause there is no game I can one CC in terms of puzzle titles on the arcades. There's not a single one I can one credit clear. I got much better 4-4 here, because for 4-4, you just have to read where Bowser's going. Easy. 
This level got much better for me. As long as you can have fun with it, that's what matters. Well, do you have a game list? Do you have a list of the games that are being done? Ooh, I got 245. I'd probably save a frame roll. Alright, tight. Alright, 5 2, I want to be safe. Alright. No lag frames, oh my gosh. Alright. No lag frames so far. This is very good. This will probably be a frame roll. Nah, that's, that's my best. Alright. Alright, gotta look at these ball pills, because this is gonna be scary. Actually, you could probably post it in Discord, so when I finish when I finish this, I can check it out. Did I really gold? Did I really gold this split? I don't think, I don't think I'm supposed to. Nice. So far, so good. Only one death. Now it's in 3-1. So far, so good. This is probably roughly the best pace I've ever had. Um... This is almost my best run. I don't wanna take chances. Dang it, I didn't despawn the plant. Alright, I'm not sure if I'm gonna get fireworks here. It all depends. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get fireworks. I got three, dang it. <laughs> I got three. Alright. That's fine. Oh, it late split. Uh... Uh-oh. I didn't want fireworks, man. <laughs> all right, if I get, all right, when I get in the world seven, I'm gonna minimize chat. World seven's not fun. No lag. What? Alright, chat's minimized for the rest of the run. Alright, this is looking really good, actually. 1946 BPT in the World 7, okay. Alright, let's see how this stage goes. Good. 
probably could have slowed down a bit for fireworks. This is, this is pretty good. Alright. I wasn't expecting, uh... I wasn't expecting to already get a very deep paced attempt. Already in the first... first attempts of the stream. Oh no, this blooper. Uh... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, these cheap cheeps. Alright, I don't want I don't want any of them to be in the way in 7-3. Alright, 7-3 could be problematic if they get in the way. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh no. Let's see. Okay. Alright, this is looking interesting. High photo move. Alright, read Bowser, get in the world of eight. Hang it. That's two that's two seconds. That's fine. I am I'm way far ahead right now. Almost four seconds ahead of my run. Uh, almost four seconds ahead of my best pace. Alright. Safe strats. Get a six. Oh dang it, it was a six. Alright, that's three seconds. Eight dash two, I have a consistent strategy for the ending, so I can easily predict what will happen. So eight two should be straightforward. Eight three is pure luck. Eight three is purely luck based, so if I die, I'm not going to be able to make it. Alright, I want, I want the Hammer Brothers in 8-3 to not jump with me. My usual strategy is to just jump over every, every one of them, but... If I get caught in any of them, this will be rip. So I just want him to try to get out of my way. Alright, stay low. <laughs> what? No! No! Oh my god! Oh my god, no. Oh my god, no. This is not what I imagined. This is not what I imagined. Oh my god, no. Ah, uh, computer, stop lagging. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god, no. 
That is the worst possible choke. Alright, I need a two frame wall jump. A4. Only thing worse that can happen now is I die to a Potaboo. That's fine. Scrolled it way far. Uh oh. Oh dear. I'm jumping, Bowser. Did I do it? Did I just do it? I have no words. I have no words, man. That is the most depressing choke I've ever seen in my life. God damn it. I died in A3. I died in A3. I choked it, man. Still a PB. I still, I still managed to break my record. Oh. I'm, I'm sad. I only beat it by half a second. God damn it, man. I had to jump Bowser to clutch it. I got hit by Bowser's hammer, so that would have been pretty much the worst ending ever. I completely choked a 19. I died in 8-3. I died in 8-3. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I actually choked 8-3. I, ch I choked 8-3, man. That would have been it. That would have been it. God damn it, dude. This would have been it. This would have been it, man. If I didn't die in 8-3. This could have been it. This could have been it. This could have been it. I can't believe this. I can't believe this, man. Look at how far ahead I was. I was 25 seconds ahead in A3. Are you fucking kidding me? My only death was an early one in 3-1, and that was all that happened. And I completely choked 19 because of A3. And even died to the Hammer Brothers, I, f I messed up a staircase jump at the end, which you should never mess up considering, like, considering how much I do, considering how much I practice World 8 for any percent and stuff, I don't know how this happened twice. Like, this happened two times in a row. God damn it, man. This could have been it. This could have been a 19. And then I wouldn't have had to play with Smallmer anymore. Now I have to keep doing it. I can't believe I only PB by a second. I only PB by a second, man. That was all because of 8-3. If I didn't die in E3, this probably would have been like a 1951 or something. That would have fucking been a killer. I would have completely murdered my PB if I didn't die in E3. Like, look. 
from minus 25 to plus 3. You cannot be any more stupid than this. Like, seriously, wh what was my best possible time going in A3? Like, what was my best possible time? Because I feel like it would have been, like, a low 1950s if I didn't die in A3.